I did some cleaning up in my garage and I found this very cool meter. I've um, been looking for it for a long time. Um, I bought it about 10 years ago from a Marktplatz in the Netherlands. This is an old AEG meter and it's got two discs. It's really cool. Top disc you'll see running, hopefully. Take the cover off. And uh, the bottom disc is there. It's not running at the moment. Uh, the type is, a, I think it's an OLJF. I'll get a close up shot on the nameplate shortly. It is an OLJF meter, AEG rated at 10 ampere, 220 volts, 1200 revolutions per kilowatt hour, made by AEG Berlin. Um, it is a maximum demand meter, it's got a register, kilowatt hour register with uh, six number drums, four for the kilowatt hours and two for the decimals. And it's got a maximum demand indicator as well, which is quite cool. And I'll take the cover off shortly. Meter has been in use by the Gemeente Enschede or the Council of Enschede in the Netherlands. That's in the province of Overijssel. Um, my guess is this must be 1920s at least, this meter. Maybe even earlier. But it is a beautiful device and I'm going to take the cover off now. Terminations are European, that's active in. Brown, red out, active out. Neutral in, blue. And black neutral out. So. MMLL. Be some load on the meter. I got about nine and a half ampere on there. Nine and a half ampere on the meter. It's gonna enjoy the discs spinning for a while. And I'll zoom this in a little bit before I take the cover off. So it's a 1200 RPM meter. So it runs pretty fast. Got a maximum demand dial, I'm not sure if that works, so we'll see. There's supposed to be a little pusher dial in the center of the meter sitting on the 30 degree mark. So we'll see how that's going to perform. Yeah, I think it's moving up. We'll see if we get a better shot of that. And a little needle that's sit now more or less in line with the screw here. So that's pushing up, eventually we're exceeding the 30 degree mark and it will go up. So it says on the dial, 1 degree is 16.95 watts. So 10 degrees is 169. So 100 degrees is 1.69 kilowatts. So 2 kilowatt heater should get it probably about the 110 mark. Decase the meat, I'll take the cover off. I think we can get it off. <coughs> and have we got the inside? Absolutely beautiful piece of equipment. Instrumentation here. Go over it. Hopefully, get some good footage of this device. It all fits in the LJC series. So we've got a Ferrari's disc driven timer, 15 minute timer, which has an adjustable screw. It is this thing here, which is accessible via the outside for calibration purposes. Be this sealed knob here next to the device. And it's driving the device. Oh, let's let this circulate. Beautiful all metal gear train. It's 
stunning amount of gears in here, beautifully made. Nice clockwork motor. I'll put some stuff on the barbecue at the meantime. <laughs> Making the video, the micro video, and barbecue at the same time, which is all good. So the meter is just sitting down the road a little bit here on the test plateau on the deck. Fantastic. The heater's switched off because it's quite warm. The fire's disc is still ticking. Didn't focus on the meter, and it's the needle has gone up to 70 plus degrees, so that component is working. I'm happy about that. Very nice. Very, very nice. Can't be the testing meters. Eating outside. These meters spinning. Amazing device. I got the Fleur camera out. So you're winning for a while, see the difference in uh, temperatures on the coals. Casing is uh, very well made. This glass got broken, it's got a bit of plastic in there. But um, that's alright. Just get the dust out of the mechanism. Typical. Brass inserts, well made cover this. Clockwork mechanism. Cats about points. This is pure beauty. This is just absolutely amazing engineering to make a meter like this. This meter is probably a hundred years old by now. It still works. It works fantastic.
people who appreciate this technology will enjoy watching this video. AG Berlin 1920-1925 I would say. I can't give an exact detail. As somebody who worked at AEG can give me more details would be appreciated. But I would take this meter up to probably close to a hundred years. But just for people on my channel who don't know much about electricity meters, but these are old electromechanical meters. This is the voltage call, it measures the voltage. That's the current call that passes all the current which get taken into the load of the house. This meter is rated at 10 ampere, maybe 20, 25 max. So uh, yeah, that's the old concept of a Ferrari's disc meter. Um, solid state meters have a different way of measuring the power used. Again, I've said before in other videos, daylight is your best asset. You can have, uh, when you make any videos, can't beat it. Just absolutely perfect. Oh, the meter has stopped, the bottom part. And in some thermal images, this was the plug. That was another plug. This was one of the plugs, or oh, radio blaring, that's the watt meter. That's the heater used as test load. That's the cat. A load of the heater.